By spending hundreds of millions of dollars on homelessness, a new audit found San Diego has failed to track and report where that taxpayer money is going. Good evening, I'm Jesse Pagan. I'm Carlo Cicchetto. That new state audit also found that the city has not even evaluated how effective many of their homelessness programs are. CBS 8's Richard Allen is here with more on what else the audit uncovered and how city leadership is responding. Richard. Well, that's right. According to this new audit, the state of California has spent $24 billion over the past five years on homelessness, during which time homelessness has actually increased by 32%. The results of the audit were frustrating for me. Assemblymember Josh Hoover is one of four state legislators who requested this audit more than a year ago. The state has completely failed to track homelessness spending in California. Uh, it has failed to collect data and assess the outcomes of the spending. The audit specifically examined five statewide programs, determining that only two, Project Home Key, which converts hotels into housing, and CalWORKs housing support for low-income Californians, were likely cost-effective. The others, though, lacked enough data to establish whether or not they work to combat homelessness. The first step has to be we have to increase transparency of these programs and demand, the legislature must demand, that these programs are collecting data, reporting the results, and measuring the effectiveness. The audit also examined the homelessness spending by the cities of San Diego and San Jose. Neither of them centrally track and report their spending and outcomes. Neither one of them have evaluated the effectiveness of their homeless programs. This comes as no surprise to me. Homeless advocate Michael McConnell says he believes this audit highlights the city's lack of accountability when it comes to combating homelessness. They've been getting so much money and, and have very little to show for it. San Diego Mayor Todd Gloria pushes back on that, saying that the city has prudently spent the funds provided by the state to help us address homelessness, adding that last year 11,440 people were served through its homelessness program supported by state funds, doubling the number of shelter options and expanding programs to get San Diegans into permanent housing. He goes on to say that all of us can use this audit as a tool to understand how much more needs to be done in order to continue meaningfully addressing homelessness. And we hope to impress on state leaders the need for adequate and ongoing funding for California's biggest crisis. McConnell, though, fears that little will change based on this audit. I don't think they're going to learn anything from it. They, they have their, hand, their head stuck in the sand, and they don't want to pull it out. Now, Assemblymember Hoover tells CBS 8 that while in the early stages, new legislation is being developed in response to this audit's findings. Also, if you'd like to read the mayor's statement in its entirety and also check out this new audit for yourself, just go to CBS 8.com, click on the online version of this story.